Hello and uh, welcome back everybody. My name is Casey Kepley. I'm with uh, DraftingTutorials.com and uh, today we're going to cover the uh, line option on AutoCAD. So getting started here, uh, basically the line is right up here in the home tab um, across the uh, toolbar. So just click on that or uh, if you want just type in the line command right here from the top and that will bring you over to the uh, that'll, that'll bring the cursor in here so that you can draw lines so basically all you do is just left click the mouse bring it over click again and you've got a line now you can hit escape and you've got a line uh, the other thing you can do is if you want you can continue your line so you can click it left click the mouse drag it over left click again now you're at a 90 degree angle right now you can go up 90 degrees left click again bring it on over bring it down you get the point um, we'll go ahead and erase all this the other thing you can do I want to show you something real quick uh, if you go down here to the uh, the customization uh, tab for some of your settings that you can play around with you can click on ortho mode and ortho mode if you're drawing a line it's only going to allow you to draw horizontally and vertically so you see how my my uh, line goes from zero degrees if I try to bring it down it goes directly to 90 that's the uh, ortho mode now we'll back out of that so if you're wanting to draw just straight lines horizontally or vertically ortho mode is a, a good one to use you can also click on F8 and that will turn it off F8 again turns it on the other thing you can do is use polar tracking um, and you can set your degree angle so if we go over here right now I've got to set to 45, 90, 135, and 80. So if we want to draw a line. Now ortho mode is turned off. So at this point, if I want to draw a line, I can draw diagonally at any angle. And um, <clears throat> let's see here. That's not what I wanted. So you, you may notice 45 degree angle, you can bring it down to 70 degrees on over. So that's uh, that's just drawing a simple line. Um, and that's that's it. There's, that's all there is to it. Um, the, uh, the next option I'll cover in the next video is the polyline. And the difference between these two basically is a polyline... Um, it's connected sequence of segments as you're reading here created as a single uh, planner object and I'll explain that later uh, when, when I cover the polyline but that's all I have for today if you found the information beneficial uh, go ahead and like and share the video um, go ahead and, and subscribe as well to the channel because I'm going to be creating videos moving forward that cover all these tools up here uh, one by one Okay, and I'll also cover some other information um, in regards to construction of different shapes uh, using, you know, circles, arcs, and, you know, the list goes on. But that's all I have for today. Uh, you're tuning in to DraftingTutorials.com. And again, uh, share and like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.